Hi, welcome to the official.ai tutorial video on the breakdown of the more filters under the team image listings. To navigate to the team image listing, you're going to use your left side navigation and click on team and then team images. To get to the more filters, you're going to use this blue down arrow, click on it, and more filters will pop up. You can search by any of these filters at a single time, or you can utilize all of the filters at one time or any combination of these filters. I'm gonna go ahead and go through all of them in detail. The metadata filter will let you search for images in the team images based on the metadata that has been tagged to the image. Photo taken underwater, no fish in photo, not a real fish, an x-ray image, a test photo, and if the image should be included in the object detection model. And just by simply clicking on the filter, it will apply it. Fish traits, you can search by fish traits that have been drawn for the fish. You can um, choose from mouth form, caudal fin, head shape, eyes, body patterns, pelvic or ventral fins, adipose fin shape, dorsal fin shape, pectoral fin, anal fin shape, finlets, body scales, and body lateral line. You can search for images based on the age of the fish if that information has been entered on the images. You can search by adult fish, eggs or larvae, a fossil, fry, juvenile, or larvae. My mistake, eggs and larvae are separate. You can search by sex of the fish, male, female, unknown, or unset. You can search if um, the fish is in a spawning phase. So true would be true for um, spawning phase. False would be false for um, spawning phase. So that would be in the non-spawning phase of that fish. Unknown would be if unknown was selected. And unset means that none of those are selected. You can search by copyright data. You can search by the last time an image was updated. So if you're only looking for images that were updated yesterday, you can do a custom range or images only by this week, only by images that were updated this month, images that were only updated by this year, images that were updated within the last week, within the last month or within the last year. You can search by a certain fish species. By simply typing in the fish species name here in the search bar and then selecting it. And you can search by if the image was assigned to an individual or not. You can search by the owner of the fish or I'm sorry, owner of the image. You can also search by images modified by certain team members by simply typing their name in here or scrolling down and selecting their name and then clicking on the confirm button. If you have an image ID, a specific image ID that you're looking for, you can type in the image ID here and search for it. If there are custom tags that you have assigned to certain images and you want to search by those, you can type those tags in here. And if you want to search by a specific file name, you can search um, by your file name typed in here. That is the breakdown of all of these additional filters that we have um, for our our teams to utilize um, within their teams.